So I have been back in, been back home on Lakeside for going on three days now, and I mean, it's all it's all someone could really ask for as far as wanting some solitude and some peace, and uh, but sometimes, and I've realized this in my life for for myself is sometimes being alone a little too alone for too long is like counterintuitive to wanting to like stay straight and like um it's always easier to fix that whenever there's somebody around to hang out with and to talk to to curb the loneliness and to like um um just to be there to talk to and sometimes it's not a very good thing because that person might end up being somebody you shouldn't really be around and that's why I don't really hang out with that many people and people I do I trust and and so yeah I'm gonna attempt to make these um videos again like I wanted to whenever I was at ER but I don't know, kind of got lost interest after the first one because it wasn't really what I wanted, thought it was going to be, but but this is where I am, and um, as for the future, I have no idea, I mean, I feel like I can't even really make the thoughts of, of like, what even what to do now, so I've decided just to come outside and do this video and let it help me vent a little bit before I go crazy and but yeah I really have no idea what I'm gonna do next I mean there's the options to go to Illinois or there's the options to go to back to Rapid and I mean but I don't know I really don't know I just in a rut stuck in a rut right now and just trying to focus day by day on what to do and but yeah Hold on, I'll be right there. So this is my Boba Fett. I had to wash him down because his cape was soaked with vodka or fireball or something. And uh, this is my Mandalorian. My City Hunter Predator. I bought him for 22 bucks at a comic book store. And this is my, my babe. She goes... Everywhere I go, my favorite Marvel character and my favorite action figure. So yeah, coop. So I had just gotten. Oh wait, so I had just. So I just got back from um, helping one of my buddies move a a fridge, a small fridge, to um, from her house to another location. But I just wanted to show you guys the. Beautiful South Dakota sunset. One of the good, probably one of the only good things about Oglala. Always has awesome sunsets. <laughs> there goes the neighbor Stuart. It's like his 50 millionth time driving by today. Good old girl on the background, <laughs> but yeah, um, gonna close this video out with this last little snippet and just uh, today has been uh, an awesome day. It's been a a good change, um, different experience than I've that I've had since being back from ER and and. Um, just the peace and the <clears throat> encouragement and uh, knowing that I'm not alone in this whole thing. And um, But yeah, I just, you know, one thing I do know is that God is good and he's merciful and he's forgiving. And, and I know, I know that he's called me into something in this life and, and I'm ready to search that out and do what it takes and and I just pray for strength for them 
for the times that will come when I'll be faced with the temptation to drink and smoke and just hope that I'll be strong. And, uh, yeah, so I'll continue. I'm going to continue to make these videos, hopefully on a daily basis. And I'll be posting, posting them to YouTube, so I'll kind of have like a archive to look back on. But, so yeah, so today is, uh, it's going to be 9 o'clock. And it is Thursday, July 30th. In Oklahoma, again, eaten alive by mosquitoes. <laughs> so, God bless you guys, and have a good night. And leave a comment if you want to or can. Good night. Love you guys.